Hello, Leo. It's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of weekly general reading for in the week of March 28th through April 4th, 2022. The cards I'm using today are Fairy Lenormand Oracle cards by Q, um, Marcus Katz and Tally Goodwin. And I'm closing off with my Gilded Tarot Royale by Kiro Marchetti and Barbara Moore. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, Marcos, let's get this show on the road. All right. Shouldn't be doing that with these big cards. I know my hands are weak. <laughs> All right, let's keep going. What's going on with the Leo? Leo, Leo, Leo. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, so we got card number 10 here. So I do feel like, ooh, I feel like somebody's getting ready to do some cleaning. I feel like some money getting ready to come in for somebody to clean and change and move stuff, okay? All right, so we got card number 21 here. So I do feel like there's going to be a lot of obstacles surrounding this situation. So it's not going to be an easy thing, okay? So, you know, you start one project and you, you open up the floor and next thing you know, you got a mold problem. You clean the mold problem and then you find out you got all this other stuff, okay? Figure out bugs, all kinds of stuff, okay? So, definitely some spring cleaning might be going on here, okay? So, we got the ten of clubs, no, spades, ten of spades here. So, I do feel like one thing after another. I feel like a whole lot of stuff that I don't want, don't like is happening um but i do feel like somebody getting ready to try to clean up a lot of stuff before they move okay somebody could be cleaning up to move cleaning up yeah to sell okay somebody just been done wrong too many times but one thing after another you know that car did you just keep fixing and next thing you know you paying more and fixing a car than you would have in a car note okay add the last three months up and and, and, and mechanic bills and divided by three and that's how much you would have been paying a car note of okay so it's like somebody's get, getting rid of something so i'm just ain't adding up okay so we got the walking away eight of hearts and we got card number 32 here so uh, yeah i do feel like somebody is recognizing that this is not what they want and they, they walking away from it okay and it's crazy because I do feel like somebody has been feeling this way for a long time. But I do feel like whatever this last thing that happened, it was just, this is it. <laughs> okay. This is it. This is all. All right. So we got card number four here. So I do feel like, yeah, this is definitely about home and family. And I do feel like some kind of offers is getting ready to come in. Somebody could be moving forward with uh, some kind of relationship or, or moving forward with someone Possibly even communication about leaving this place. Okay. Move with me. Let's move away. Okay. All right. All right. Card number 17. So this is about new beginnings. Okay. Deliveries. Rebirth. Returning. Okay. So I do feel like whatever this is, is going to rejuvenate, restart uh, a relationship or just the energy Childish energy, the happy energy inside of you, okay? All right, so we got card number 36. So it looks like somebody's been praying for this quite some bit. This six of clubs makes me feel like um, success there. Uh, but I do feel like somebody just wants some kind of change, wants some kind of answers, and they're doing some praying for it, okay? All right, so we got card number 12 here. Then we got this seven of diamonds so i do feel like with this seven of diamonds somebody's waiting for some kind of results um with this 12 here i do feel like a lot of messages is getting ready to get out about what's going on so the word is out that you're selling the house or selling whatever this is um so now we got the seven of diamonds it's just a waiting period okay just a waiting period but i do feel like success is coming okay so let's keep going on with this leo What's going on with the Leo? What's going on with the Leo? 
What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Leo, Leo, Leo. All right, so we got the five of wands reverse here. So this makes me feel like um, somebody was just doing a lot of fighting, okay, emotionally about, <clears throat> sorry, being at this place, staying at this place, and now it's over, okay? Now it's getting ready to be over. King of Swords. Somebody's analyzing the situation to see what is best for them and moving forward with that, okay? Like, what is best for, for these pockets? Okay. All right, so we got the death card reversed here. So this makes me feel like definitely some kind of toxic situation somebody been sitting in. I do feel like it's been messing with you a lot being at this place, okay? Being here. Like it's, it's somebody sitting back and realizing all the stuff that they don't like in this. All right, so we got the Wheel of Fortune here. So I do feel like the luck is getting ready to change, okay? And it looked like it's getting ready to change because you've been getting ready to toss out this previous thing and move forward, okay? Move with something forward with something bigger and better, okay? All right, so we got the Hermit card, three major arcanas, definitely a life lesson for somebody, okay? But with this Hermit card here, this makes me feel like... Yeah, a lot of depression associated with this. It's like you driving around and like, I don't know when this dang on car going to break down, okay? Or walk in the house and be like, I don't know what's about to break now. What's next? I can't even sit on the couch in peace because I'm listening for crazy noises, okay? Okay. So let's see what's going on with this death card. Reverse here. One card for the Leo. I'm breaking out. <laughs> okay. So we got the eight of swords reverse here. So somebody was feeling like they were stuck somewhere. Somebody was feeling like they had no choice but to leave. Yeah. Somebody just wanted to go. Go get away. Somebody felt like they couldn't do it. Okay. But now somebody feeling like and knowing that they can. They're not locked here. They don't have to stay anywhere, okay? So you know how we're getting ready to end something and we think about all the good things, you know? Somebody was doing that for a little while, but now it's over, <laughs> okay? It's over, you know? That stuff look a lot different on paper. When you write it down, what's really going on? Like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. All right, so heart heartache, like I said, is getting ready to be over, okay? And I don't know why I focused on that um, Leo card. That's you, the strength card. All right, so I do feel like you're getting ready to get into your power right now and get over this sadness of the ending, okay? Because this, this, this situation is just costing too much, okay? All right, so nine of swords reversed here. So, yeah, I do feel like once you leave this place and get into another place, I feel like nightmares are going to be at first, but I do feel like they're not going to last that long. You're just going to get over it pretty quick, okay? Anxiety and all that good stuff is going to be here for... A while until you sign those papers and get out, then bliss. All right. Other than that, that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.